As we mentioned, many of the injured remain in hospitals this morning. Nick and Leanne Yanni were watching a friend in the race when they were hit from, by shrapnel from the blast. They're at Tufts Medical Center this morning. Nick and Leanne, good morning to both of you. Good morning. Go, and Leanne, let me just start right off by asking, how are you doing? I can see the neck brace. Your leg is propped up. What's the extent of your injuries? I have a uh, open fibular fracture and I'm waiting to uh, get a skin graft um, either today or tomorrow and then probably be put in a boot to, for the last part of the healing. And Nick, how about you? Were you injured as well? Uh, I was uh, fortunate. I only had a pierced uh, eardrum. Leanne, to describe for me how close you were to the finish line, how close you were from where these devices were detonated. Um, I'm not sure exactly where it was detonated. It sounded awfully close. We were probably about 10 feet from the finish line. Um, yeah, it was, it was quite loud and uh, definitely could smell the smoke and everything when it happened. And, and Nick, I understand when you looked down and saw the extent of Leanne's injuries, you went into shock. How long was it before either of you could get to the hospital and were you able to stick together? Um, no, when the police came in, they, uh, you know, they wanted to get anybody who wasn't hurt out and uh, so they could take care of everybody who was hurt. Um, we were close enough to the bomb that went off uh, um, by the finish line that there, were, there was a lot of, uh, a lot of bad things uh, going on and everybody was just trying to help everybody. It was probably about 15 minutes, if not more, by the time I was carried from uh, Marathon Sports to the med uh, medical tent, and then I got loaded onto an ambulance after that. Yeah, I just I had to sneak to the back of the medical tent so that I could try to find my wife. Well, I'm glad you two are back together. Leanne, I wish you luck with the surgery as you described it a little bit earlier. Our thoughts are with you. Thank you so much.